Okay guys, this is going to be for my YouTube channel. I just finished doing a live uh, video feed on Facebook and my phone. I don't know what, what it is about this phone. I'm not going to be able to do live feeds when it's when it's warm out. I'm just going to have to wait and do those in the in this winter time when it's cool because um, it shut it off. So I'm way back here in, in Bigfoot Creek today. Um, None of this is going to look familiar to, to, to any of you because I have not been back this far. But this area right here um, is what I call a, a camp. Um, some of you call them wallows. Um, but the creek, this is Bigfoot Creek. Um, now it's not really called Bigfoot Creek. Um, it's just a, it's a name that, uh, that I've given it. Uh, with a couple other researchers that I've shown out here um, we frequent we used to frequent this area and we wanted to name it something it's it's got another name and I didn't really want you, if you look it up on a map you can uh, by name then you can find it pretty easy and I don't really want a bunch of people coming out here and, and disturbing this so um, and if my phone dies, or if my phone shuts off, this video shuts off, it's because it's overheating again. Um, basically what I'm, do, I'm gonna do is just, I'm just taking a video on my way out. Um, there were some structures that, were, that I thought I saw back here last time and I wanted to come check them out. One of, one of them uh, was this right up here. Looks like it could just be something the little critter did, but um, added to it anyway. Now, when I show you the tree, this tree is humongous. It got pushed over, but something is added to the root system of it. Big tree, very big tree. But you can see all the brush that's been added to it. This is a humongous tree, it's been pushed over. The growled at video. Um, oh, about fell there. Was probably maybe a quarter mile this way. That's the video that I found one of their I call them jungle gems, or it's a den, and uh, I think I got too close to something because I was growled at. I mean, it was a deep, guttural, loud, shook my shook my organs. It was so loud. I'm getting some vocals behind me, so I'm gonna do move my camera back that way for a minute, where I was just at in that Bigfoot camp. Whew. Beautiful day today, guys. Perfect day to be out. Now, this is another fork of a creek. What was that? It's got a wood knot back there too. And I think, I always get the feeling that that's their area on that side. And as long as I stay over here on this side, I feel like I'm not intruding. Um, and the day I got growled at, I was on their side, so. Uh, but there is so much over there. Look at this tree. 
another huge tree. It's laid up inside of here. And that that is a humongous tree. Here's a game trail. There's a hunter's ribbon. I don't know if anybody, if you guys can see that. Let me zoom in. A hunter's ribbon. There is hunting in this area, um, in, in most of it. snaps but stick breaks like something's walking a lot of this was wildlife management areas um, there's bow hunting and uh, and rifle hunting the rifle hunting is only eight days long. You can think you can archery hunt out here all year. That sounds like a dog. That's like a dog right behind me. Yelping. I don't know if my camera picked that up or not. And yes, guys, today I am recording on, I'm still recording on my phone. Um, and the reason for that is, um, I got to looking at a lot of my SD cards that I've got. Um, I've got several of them. And I've used them so much, I've recorded and deleted and recorded and deleted so much on them that the quality, I don't know if the quality deteriorates or, um, and there's, there's just, there is some video that I'm going to upload uh, to this channel, but uh, I need to buy some new SD cards for that camera, um, but as many of you know, there's the, here's the jungle gym right here, zooming on it. As many of you know, uh, I did get a new laptop. So, um, I can start recording with my camcorder and stop using this phone. Um, but I need to buy some S. It's a the camcorder is an HD camera. I don't know if I want to walk up to that or not. There's one over here. <laughs> That's one den, and here's the big one that I've shown on camera before. I don't know that I've ever. I don't know that I've ever walked up to that one. This one over here is amazing. This one here. Now to any, to some of you new guys who are watching me do this, um, and I have given my phone number out to a couple people uh, that are new. You know, I'm still relatively new to this. I've only been doing this for three years, a little over three years. 
But when you see something like this, don't just go charging for it. You know what? If you want to check it out, I always say keep your distance. If you want to, if you really want to check it out, walk 10 feet, stop. Walk 10 feet, stop. You know, and and don't just look behind you. I mean, don't just stay glued to what you're. You don't stay glued to your target because if if you don't uh, if you're not aware of your surroundings, you can be and you can get yourself in a real pickle. So. Um, Standing on a stranger mound here, and then uh, also listen to your gut feelings. I mean, you know, your, your body can sense whether you're in a in a uh, you're in a bad situation or not. And if it's telling you to leave, I would listen to it. So. not seen this before this is one of them that I have not been to look at this oh wow I have not been into this and I got a black something some black back here what is that that thing moves, then I'm going to back out. Look at this, guys. Wow. just a bunch of deadfall right here and we've got the classic this is a you know I a lot of the places in Oklahoma that I've been to I see these I call them a-frame um, and I, I think it's a clan the the sign of a of the clan um, or tribe whatever you want to call it uh, here in Oklahoma, I see them a lot. So that's new. And it's right next to the big, this is the big den right here. You know, that's an area I'd love to go check out back in there, but not by myself. You can see how dark it gets back in there. Here's the big jungle gym. Big jungle gym den. A little spider on me. Why is my camera so blurry. You know what? I think this is it. I don't think I've shown this one. I think the one that I've got on my other videos is further back that way. This may be a new one. No. Tell you what, let's walk around here and find out. But you can see it's being used. All this brush is, is all worn down inside.
Yeah, they're in here. They're hearing me coming. Yeah, I've, okay, now I remember I have gotten this one. This is the same one. And the reason I know is because of all the stuff that's laid at back right here. I'm getting pretty close to the grout at where I got grout at video. Here's another uh, jungle gym. Jungle gym den. Big tree pushed over. A lot of, a lot of hunters ribbon in here. I've, I haven't noticed that much before. I wonder if there's been someone in here setting up a deer stand somewhere. Yeah, here's where. Okay. This is the exact path I took when I got growled at. I came up here like this. Was checking this tree out. I crossed over here. I came over here. And back here I was seeing something black. A black shape. Look how big these trees are. Humongous. And see, I'm on their side right now. I gotta be careful. Right back here is where I got growled at. I was standing right here and I could see a black shape back in this direction somewhere. Whoa! Whew. Oh shit. Sorry, excuse my language. I just had a rabbit. I almost stepped on the damn thing. I had a rabbit. Whoa, big snake. Big snake. I don't know if you guys can see that. I gotta get out of here. There's too much creepy crawlies. This, we killed a den of rattlesnakes just the other day at, out of a cemetery with a mow at. I don't know what kind of snake that was. You know what? I, I also. Noticed another. Oh no, I've seen that one before. Okay. There's a tree lane.
Okay, I think I'm going to cut this off and start making my way back towards the creek. Um, that's actually the first time I've seen a snake in here. I hate snakes. I hate them. Uh, but I, we mow several properties out, out west out here and this, this year we've been seeing them thick, so i got to be real careful. I don't know what kind of snake that was. It didn't look poisonous, but you never know. All right, guys. Well, I didn't see a whole lot today. No foot, didn't see any footprints. I got some uh, wood knocks and um, sound like a little girl back there. I don't know what that was. Could have been just the tree creaking. It is was pretty windy today, so it's hard to it's hard to distinguish sounds. Um, so I'm over 20 minutes. Uh, I took you back a little further today. That's really about as, I mean, this creek goes along, it goes all the way to the lake. But as you can see, it gets closer to get to the lake, the thicker the vegetation, so. Um, and I'm not walking through that. Uh, when it gets uh, colder, winter time, all this is gonna start dying off and then I can take you guys and a lot of this area. Um, but you got to see a little bit, uh, a little bit more today, and I hope you enjoyed it. Take care, guys.